In this section of the video series, we're going to talk about tasks within Podio. Tasks are a way to make sure that if something needs to get done within your organization, whether it's by you or one of your employees, that it has a specific due date and that we don't forget about it so that it gets done on time. So to create a new task here in Podio, on pretty much any screen that you're in, whether it's an app, a workspace, or a particular item within an app, you should see this icon that looks like a box with a check mark inside of it. That is the Create a Task button. Now at the same time, if you just click the key T on your keyboard, and I'm going to do that right now, the new task pop-up will appear. This is the same pop-up that would come up if I had clicked the new task button here in Podio. And you can see that we can go ahead and create a new task. So I'm going to call this task follow-up call with Acme Dairy Products. We'll say I need to call them about a new project initiative. So down here I can go ahead and I can assign this task to anybody that I'd like and when I click in that box you'll notice that a list drops down allowing me to select people within my organization. If I had a lot of people within my organization I could go ahead and I could start typing their name and it would narrow down my results. So I'm just going to assign this task to myself, Anson Alexander. I can specify a due date for this task, so it, I can say it's due tomorrow, and I can even specify a particular time, and for a follow-up call, that might be necessary. So we'll say that this is at 1 p.m., and you'll notice that because I was in the Leads and Clients app within the Sales Workspace, when I clicked the T button to create a task, it is automatically associating this task with the Leads and Clients Workspace. Now, in this particular situation, although that is somewhat helpful, I can narrow this down even further by associating this particular task with the Acme Dairy Products Company. That way, when I view this task, I can simply click on the name of the company and it will take me to the page within Podio that has all of that company's information. So, I'm just going to click in this box and I'm going to delete out the leads and clients connection and I'm going to type Acme Dairy. You'll notice that we have two results that come up. That's because we have a leads and clients app within our demo workspace and our sales workspace. But we're working within our sales workspace right now. So I'm going to choose the second one because I can see that that is the one inside of the sales workspace. I can choose whether other people in this organization are allowed to see the task. Shared tasks, people who have access to this particular workspace would be able to see it. I could also make the task private if I'd like and then I can go ahead and enter some information about the task. If I'd like to, I could attach a file. Maybe there's a certain document associated with this particular task. I can make this task repeat, so it might be a weekly or daily task. And then I can also set up a notification reminder for this task. Now, in a minute here, I'm going to show you how you can review all of the tasks that are assigned to you within Podio. So if you are using Podio every day and you're keeping an eye on your tasks list, you might not need a reminder. But if it's a very important task that you want to make sure you don't miss, you can go ahead and click the Remind Me button. And you can choose whether you want to be reminded on the particular due date, 10 minutes before, 30 minutes before, whichever one that you feel is most beneficial for you. And then when you're ready, you can go ahead and click the Create Task button. You'll notice that it just takes me back to my Leads and Clients area within Podio. And in the next video in this series, I'm going to show you how you can review all the tasks that are assigned to you. So we'll be able to see this task in my tasks list.